Hello everyone, this is Personman14, and welcome to Deadlight. This is my third attempt at recording this game, and probably my final if it doesn't work. I really enjoyed this game. I only played the first chapter three times. But, 53%, what's that mean? I don't know, but, uh, let's get into it now, shall we? Every time I've watched a cutscene, it has aired. Not every time, but like any time I've been recording, the cutscene has aired. Just like sharks. When they stop moving, they die. That's how you are, Carla. Save yourself. After the storm came the calm and silence that make men crazy. Carla! Carla! Why? Why? Randy, can you tell me what the fuck happened here? She's been bitten everywhere. She knew she shouldn't have gone outside. You killed her, you bastard! You murdered her! She's dead! What, what the hell have you done? Why? We'd all be dead by now because of your little sister. How many times have we said Why? not to separate from the group? Never means never. Shot drawing their attention even more. Either we reach the military shelter that you talk about so much, Grandpa, or we'll die right here. The radio message said that it was around here. It's a bit more than five miles west. Let's get out of here. Come on! I'm not leaving my sister here all alone. Nothing can be done now, Stella. Sam, Ben, Stella, get out of here. Get to the sea. I'll meet you. I've got to find my family. It's the only place they could have gone. Stay strong, Randy, and good luck. I know we'll find them. That day was not the beginning of anything or the end of something. It was just one more day. A day like any other. The world was dying, and we were its survivors. There we go. Part one. Good luck, Randy. Let me grab your hair. Her body is full of bites and bruises. That's... She's been shot point blank in the head. Why is it surprising to you? Waste no time. Let's go. Intense tutorial go. Seattle Safeway must be the last stronghold in all the Pacific Northwest. Anybody alive must be trying to reach it. There's a diary entry in there. Oh, Mr. Deadman doesn't have a name tag anymore? Alright, let's push. Hello? Oh, you say please fall. Thank you. Push, push, push. Climb, climb, climb. I'm not using a controller. Fuck you. Uh, 
Yeah, that felt good. The jumping in this game is a little janky, and uh, I don't know if it caught it because I had started the recording a little late. This game's made by Microsoft Studios. Make this failure at everything. God damn. So decrepit. Ben and the others made it out. They deserve better than this world. Why don't I? Why do only they deserve better? You got a good kick, man. In there. Go. And I apologize again. It says here the highway is at the end of this tunnel. It's a straight shot to the safe point. Shannon and Lydia might even be there by now. I apologize again for uh, lack of my video, but the last few times I've tried to turn it on and record after about four seconds, my video camera stops and freezes all of OBS. How is other people, if you wish another to keep your secret, to keep it to yourself, the inferno begins here. Welcome to hell. Dead people, corpses, they don't impress me anymore. Of course I can't swim. No platformer is complete without a swimless antagonist. Or whatever. Protagonist. Protagonist can't swim. That's how you know you're gonna be the hero, guys. If you can't swim, that's step one for good hero training. They're so much faster than me. Up, oh, you dumbass. Really? <sighs> Jumping in this game is so janky. It's fucking obnoxious. Unless you like tap the button right before you like the direction you want to go, he just does this. No matter what. Doesn't matter if you're walking and hit that button, he won't do shit. Right now I'm spamming spacebar, and obviously he's not doing shit. Fuck you. No way in hell you should have caught up to me. I'm hitting spacebar. Thank you. No, no, no. Boy, stay. Tab. 
According to the map, I should cross this highway to get closer to the safe point. This is yeah. it. This is what's left of our world now. Dead loud. These are the leftovers of the war between men and shadows. A snapshot of what we become. Bloody hell on earth. I really, really love the backgrounds in this though. They did really good designing on this game. So pretty. And I know I sound sarcastic, but I mean it. Like, it, look at all the detail in this. Uh, nowhere safe. Why did that happen? What? Why did it wait to break for the second he was near? Cells junkyard. I found a firefighter's axe. Take the head with you. Thanks, buddy. Click to destroy shit. See what I mean by jumping is janky. Thank you. No time to waste. Stamina for it. Can't think it's safe to continue. I didn't realize stamina was taken while you hang. I learned something in this playthrough. Alright. kill you when I put an axe in your forehead, but slowly and steadily. Oh my god, swing down. Thank you. Swing. Swing. Downward. Thank you. Alright. Stamina in a minute. Lydia? No. I must be tired. My mind is wandering. Is this the build? Yes. Now, if you go over here, there's a diary entry in this locker, which I've already obtained. And that's after he hears the voice. So clearly, if he's obtaining things from his diary, I know he's been here before. So. Part of me is thinking he forgot that his wife is dead, or something like I. That's just a theory of mine. I said it last time, and I feel bad that I don't have the original commentary because of the weirdest thing that's ever happened. How did you get down there? Um, I don't know what happened. Quite honestly, all of my audio turned into like static. It's like double possessed. If you guys are interested, I'll put up the uh, gargle iffy audio. So you guys can see what I mean, so I'm not full of shit. But yeah, if you guys want to see that, let me know. And if you guys want to see more of this game, let me know, because I think it's really interesting. I think it could be something a really good series. Shit! Oh shit, there's too many of them! Up and over. Oh, 
Oh, you almost killed me. You were really close. You almost got me. Where's my medkit? I definitely need one. There it is. Now, let's see if when the last time I played it actually was... Oh, it's full heals. That's cool. Alright. See if it was actually an error. I can hear something. I don't understand, man. If he's already dead, why do we need to hang him? Power must be made visible. They should know that we're keeping watch on them. Who? Those things? No, I mean the survivors. Besides, what the hell do you care? Orders are orders. <laughs> Come on, let's go get the next one. God! Waste of time. Hey, buddy. What lasts longer? Bricklayer's house or the house? <laughs> this is the second time this has happened. I bet you a hundred bucks you can't solve it. A carpenter's? Listen, when someone asks you something like that, you just answer them the toughest house is the gravediggers. All gravestones last forever, till fucking doomsday. What an asshole. Yeah, he's fucked. Shoot him three times, he's still going. Panic and run away. That's the second time I've been to this cutscene, and it's happened both times. It's fucking bullshit. What did they mean keeping an eye on the survivors? Orders from who? And I think this is where I'll cut the first episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. If you do, let me know, and I'll keep playing it. Otherwise, I'll move on to something else. So, bye.